a child is born, the computer brain <laughs> is ready to work, uh, but it needs programs. And so the first seven years of our life, the brain is operating at a lower level than consciousness. In, in EEG, electroencephalograph terms, uh, the brain is operating at a vibrational frequency called theta. Evolution is a sequence of pattern, okay? That's what I discover in my work, okay? So in other words, uh, evolution isn't based on genetics. That's completely wrong. <laughs> it's completely wrong because a human has 20,000 genes and the most simple worm, simple worm they studied with only 1,271 cells has 20,000 genes. Uh, so, inevitably, anything that we really struggle to find, whether it's a relationship, a good job, uh, health, whatever you're looking for, and you're struggling to manage to get it, is it because the universe doesn't give it to us? That's our perception, because we don't even see we're involved. We just see the result. I'm not successful. And therefore, must be the universe is the problem because I want to be successful. It's not happening. Therefore, the universe, uh, you know, I'm a victim. That's mm -hmm. what we got to clear up. You're training these kids to hate other people. When they were born, they didn't even know other people. And in the early stages, when you said, those people, the ones we hate, even the kid doesn't know who the heck you're talking about, but learns the program. And the program is, I hate Arabs. I hate Jews. I go, uh, who's an Arab? Who's a Jew? Kid doesn't even know. <laughs> and then they say, oh, that's an Arab. And all of a sudden, now that person gets connected to the program, and now we have hate. Okay? So I said, your problem is you've been perpetuating violence to these kids from the time they were infants to hate the other side and that war is the resolution mm. so that was the picture called the problem and then the next slide i push the button black screen but in top it says the solution and then two pictures show up one with two girls an arab girl and an israeli girl walking uh hand in hand and uh, you know and talking and you know obviously just uh, enjoying each other and the same thing with an arab boy and a jewish boy uh playing together and i said this is a solution because if if you play with your with the other people and you start to recognize they're just like you i mean what the heck does a kindergartner know from who's an arab who's a jew who's good who's bad they're playing with each other mm -hmm. and if they question why am i struggling that's the first question why am I having trouble finding a relationship? Why am I having trouble staying in health? Uh, uh, rather than going out and asking the universe, hey, what are you guys doing out here that's not giving me? It's, no, no, go inside <laughs> and say, mm -hmm. oh my goodness, uh, I am manifesting this uh, struggle. And I say, well, how do you want to get out of the struggle? I say, well, put in a program that is completely the opposite of the struggle, the one that you want. And You're not a victim of the universe if anything, you're a victim of your subconscious programs. Mm. And then all of a sudden, why is that important? Because if I perceive I'm a victim of the universe, then I say, oh, I, I have no control. It's just what happened to me. So therefore, mm. that's life. But then when we understand, wait, I am manifesting this, then all of a sudden, I go from victim to the opportunity to be master. Because if I'm...